what I'm about to show you is blatant heresy from Stephen Furtick, and it's he has said this on more than one occasion. So I'm going to show you three different video clips of Stephen Furtick. The first from 2021, second from 2019, and then the third one uh, most recently as of this recording just uh, a, a week or so ago in February of 2024. And it has to do with the little God's doctrine. Uh, Stephen Furtick has been associating with Word of Faith preachers, endorsing them, partnering with them. Um, Rod Parsley, Joyce Meyer, Rod Parsley, by the way, is one of the most egregious false teachers out there, but Rod Parsley, Joyce Meyer, and of course, T.D. Jakes, he has openly said, is his um, model and mentor in ministry and preaching and just lavishes praise on T.D. Jakes. T.D. Jakes has his own uh, heretical issues and character issues, but uh, I want to bring your attention to this. This is Little God's Doctrine. So the first clip made a lot of news back about three years ago in 2021 when Stephen Furtick said this. Don't let anybody put anything on you that will cause you to forget what God put in you. The fight that you have to win for your life has not been with them. It's always been in you. Because if you believe it's in you, there's nothing anybody can put on you that can cancel what I put in you. Before you were born, I appointed you a prophet to the nations. It's always been in you. And there's nobody that can leave my life that can keep God from keeping his covenant with me. I'm not in covenant with a person. I'm not in covenant with a political party. I'm in covenant with God Almighty. I am God Almighty. Today I'm releasing to my church my first new book in eight years. Do the new you. And you get it first. That's right. This is written so I can come home with you. Sound kind of weird. This is where I get to coach you. This is where I get to be a voice in your life that reminds you that you are the righteousness of God in Jesus Christ. The voice in your life that helps you realize that you are more than the math of what is against you. That you are more than the mistakes that you have made. That the great I am lives in you. And whatever he is, you are too. Okay, so this is Little God's Theology. This was taught by Benny Hinn and Kenneth Copeland and Paul Crouch. Uh, this is called, also called Name It and Claim It. Uh, this is the word faith movement. So if you just speak the words of faith because you are a little God, you can do whatever God can do. So God created the heavens and the earth out of nothing. Therefore, if you just believe hard enough and speak a positive confession. Joel Osteen does the same thing. This is really just Pentecostalism mixed with New Age religion, the law of attraction. If, you, if, you, if you're a positive person and you speak the words out into the universe, it'll come back to you. So if you believe that you're a champion, you're gonna be a champion. If you believe and have faith, and say, speak the words of faith that I'm going to be rich, you'll be rich. So name it and claim it, speak the words, word of faith. And this is the health and wealth prosperity gospel, that if you speak these positive confessions, God will bless you with health and wealth and all the rest. And people buy into it because, yeah, Joel Osteen and Stephen Furtick and Kenneth Copeland and Benny Hinn, they all have mansions and or private jets. They're all multimillionaires, so it seems to be working for them, but it only works for them because they're the con men. <laughs> it doesn't work for the people they're scamming, right? So that's the problem. Basically, this is this is the doctrine of Kenneth Copeland, and it's ironic because, well, I guess it, it's no surprise uh, that Stephen Furtick was actually the one to replace Kenneth Copeland on the Trinity Broadcast Network. Let's listen to what Kenneth Copeland and TBN founder Paul Crouch had to say. Listen. When I read in the Bible where he says, I am, I just smile and say, yes, I am too. 
He doesn't even draw a distinction between himself no. and... Never, never. You never can do that in a covenant relationship. Do you know what else that has settled then tonight? This hue and cry and controversy that has been spawned by the devil to try and bring dissension within the body of Christ, yeah. that we're gods. I am a little god. <laughs> yes. Yes. I have the his reason. name. I'm one with him. I'm in covenant relation. Yeah. I am a little God. <laughs> Critics, you are anything that he is. When I read in the Bible where he says, I am, I just smile and say, yes, I am too. I'm in covenant with God Almighty. I am God Almighty. Okay, so you can see that's where Furtick got his doctrine. This is the same thing that Kenneth Copeland teaches. Watch this from Kenneth Copeland. This was just last year at the Southwest Believers Convention. I actually attended this. I was there in person, yards away from him when he said this. Watch. Let this mind be in you. Let this be the way you think. Let this mind be in you, which was also in the anointed Jesus, who being in the form of God, thought it not robbery to be equal with God. And you do not think it robbery. You don't, it, it's not taking anything away from God. Right. To be equal with our Father. To be equal with our Lord Jesus. He's the one that caused it to happen. And our good God said, oh yeah, they're my children. Of course they're equal to me. I gave birth to them. Yep. Of, of course they're equal to me. The word faith movement and the mysticism upon which it is based has, they've almost dropped the little from the little God's doctrine and they just teach that we are, we are flat out equal to God. And whatever he is, you are too. All right, dear ones, thank you very much for watching. If you have friends, if you have family members that are following Stephen Furtick, show them this video. It is the, these reasons and a multitude of other reasons why Stephen Furtick is a false teacher and not someone that your friends, that your family members, that anyone should be listening to for sound biblical teaching because they are not getting it from Stephen Furtick. All right, dear ones, until our next time together, may the grace of our Lord Jesus Christ the love of God and the fellowship of His Holy Spirit be with you all.